Good day. You may be aware that modern electrical systems are either single phase or three phase. At the generation and transmission levels, these are three phase systems. So you have generators, a three phase, three phase motors, transmission lines, transformers, all a three phase systems. Now we need to consider. Uh, some of the characteristics of three phase systems and we're going to be looking specifically at the voltage waveforms of three phase systems now if we look at a star connected system a star connected system this will be a generator the symbol of a generator supplying a load All right, and these are both star connected systems so the voltages are labeled as VR, the voltage across the red phase, VY, the voltage across the yellow phase, and VB, the voltage across the blue phase. Now these voltage waveforms can be represented by these equations. So VR, you know that they are sinusoidal waveforms. So VR is equal to sine theta. It could be Vmax, and Vmax here is assumed to be 1, so Vmax sine theta. The yellow phase, the voltage in the yellow phase, is represented by sine to theta minus 120, which means that um, Vy is lagging Vr by 120 degrees. Similarly, the voltage in the blue phase would be lagging um, Vy by 120 degrees. So VB, with reference, uh, with regards to the reference, is sine into theta minus 120 degrees. Now this can be represented. So these waveforms can be represented by the sine waves. All right. So VR, we starting at at zero, and we are plotted from zero up to 480 degrees. So VR is represented by this red sine wave. VY is represented by the black sine wave because I don't have a yellow um, color and you will notice that it crosses the zero axis first here at 120 degrees right so it is actually lagging behind VR by 120 degrees notice that the blue waveform VB um, crosses um, the x-axis at 240 degrees so it is lagging VR by 240 degrees. So this is one way of um, representing the voltage waveform. There are sine waves and this shows you the sequence. Now the sequence is red, yellow, blue. Right? And as long as the power is going on, you have red, yellow, blue. Right? And it is going anti-clockwise. Now we can also represent the voltage waveform by phasors, right? and the phasor diagram here will show you the orientation of these waveforms. So the, the voltage waveform has a constant magnitude, and if you check the, the magnitude is the same for each of them, and they are all 120 degrees apart from each other. And we say that all of them are rotating anti-clockwise right? in the sequence red yellow blue now you can see from this also that there's a anti-clockwise rotation so you have to bear in mind that all phases are rotating anti-clockwise so this is the red yellow blue i would see the red first looking up if i'm my eyes this is my line of vision and the first thing i will see coming up with this rotating anti-clockwise is the red phaser followed by the yellow phaser then followed by the blue phaser so this is an easy way to to know the sequence and to react or to know the orientation of the diagram right red followed by y followed by blue when we move in the anti-clockwise direction so that in a nutshell is how you could represent the voltage waveforms of a three-phase system. Notice that this system 
would be called a balanced system. And a balanced three-phase system has the voltages having equal magnitude. Here, all the magnitudes will be one. If you look at the diagram, all the magnitudes are the same. And then the other criteria for a balanced three-phase system, another criteria is that the, the waveforms are 120 degrees apart. So you can see it here on the phasor diagram. You can see it here on this um, on the sine wave graph. All right. So that concludes our introduction to three-phase system. We have the waveform in, form, in the form of sine waves. We have the phasor diagram in the form of arrows or phasors or vectors as you would recall from maths and we have the equation that represents the waveform and this is a circuit diagram this is a star connected circuit diagram because our voltages in the star circuit now are VR, VY and VB just as we have here in the diagram alright so that is your quick introduction to the voltage waveform of a three phase system